Welcome to clickmyproject.com. Let's discuss on the title Image Super Resolution with Fast Neighbor Embedding. In this paper, we focus on any based method. The any based SR algorithm can represent more patterns even if a relatively smaller training data set is available and thus show a much stronger generalization ability for a variety of images. Nonetheless, the limitation of the any based method is twofold. The LR and HR feature mapping cannot be established well because features in the high dimensional space cannot be represented perfectly in a low dimensional space, leading to some ambiguity between LR and HR patch pairs. And the second one, the strictly fixed neighborhood size usually ends up with a blurring effect due to over or underfitting. As the aforementioned any based SR methods unexceptionally use the Euclidean distance metric to search a fixed number of neighbors for linear embedding. Due to blurring, downsampling and noisy data, this simple tactic for neighbor selection cannot perform well for image super resolution problem because the neighbor search and the minimum reconstruction error are separated into two independent processes. Moreover, neighbor search is often manipulated within the whole training data set leading to a computationally intensive process. To reduce these problems and to further improve the NE based algorithm for SR reconstruction, we propose a sparse neighborhood based that is SPNE method that takes the following factors into account. The first factor is how can the required candidates be searched to minimize the reconstruction error. And the second one, how can the computational costs suffered by the NE based algorithm be reduced effectively. To target the first problem, we develop a sparse neighbor selection that is SPNS algorithm to simultaneously search neighbors and estimate weights by incorporating a robust SL0 algorithm and a KNN criterion. For the second problem, we suggest the KNN chosen for reconstruction should have similar local geometrical structures. To this end, we partition the whole training data set into a set of subsets by clustering histogram of gradients, which is a powerful descriptor of local geometry representation. Though clustering a group of medium scale subsets can be constructed which can be effectively reduce computational time while preserving SR quality. Let's have a discussion on the data flow diagram. This is the data flow diagram. Uh, first we will be considering the upscaled LR input which will be converted into patches. The patch size is to be considered here as 10 by 10 matrix. Each patches will be subjected to HOG feature extraction. Those features will be subjected to feature selection algorithm and only the selected features will pass through the k-means clustering algorithm. Here the k-means clustering algorithm will subdivide each patches into any one of the clusters. The number of clusters mentioned here is 3 and you can also increase the number of clusters. So it becomes the ID for each patch. Depending upon the ID produced by this k-means clustering algorithm, the KNN classifier will be trained and those ID of the patches will be considered as the true label. And this classifier output will be uh, subjected to the dimension reduced feature of the correct patch. That is, which patch you are taking to synthesize will be dimensionally reduced and then subjected to cluster identity then the patch which is to be synthesized will be subjected to SPNE algorithm and uh, this SPNE algorithm will synthesize the LR patch into HR patch like that for whole image this process will be repeated and when you recombine the images you may expect some blurring effect to overcome that a TV based deblurring algorithm will be implemented followed with iterative backpropagation procedure and finally you will be getting SR output. Now let's see the execution of the program. Regarding execution of the program, this testing file is the main file. Click this and press run file. As the program is being designed as an M file, first of all you will be getting a dialog box and this is your image data set. You can take any one of the images. These are the training images. And uh, I'm collecting this image as the input image. So an LR image will be constructed. And this is the path separation output. The images will be splitted into 10 by 10 block.
after this each process will be process each patches will be processed sequentially and uh, this is the reconstructed lr image which is subjected to spne algorithm and this is the spne output and this is the enhancement made it to the spne output to remove the blurring effect we have implemented tv blazed deblurring algorithm followed by ibp enhancement and this is the time that is taken to reconstruct the patches this is the psnr value and this is the structural similarity index this is fsim value in this paper we have presented an improved ne based algorithm for image sr reconstruction by combining the sparse neighbor search and subset selection based on hog clustering to accelerate the speed of sr resolution we first employ the clustering with euclidean distance metric and we develop a novel neighbor selection scheme by introducing a variation of robust sl0 algorithm and we have made some experimental parameters to standardize our results thank you